university for PhD studies. That's an important topic for anyone who is willing to go for the advancement in the career or want to learn the research skill. You can be in any area. It's, it could be the textile, it could be the electronics, it could be chemical, or it could be the, any other branch of the science. Now, ask yourself for going to uh, have the best university for your PhD studies. The question is, can there be any university to known as the best university for your PhD studies? Think for this question. Is the best university for the PhD studies uh, the University of the Cambridge? Think yourself, would it be that one? Or it is the in USA, the uh, MIT? Is that the best university for the PhD studies? In Asia, the National University of uh, Singapore? Is that the best university option? In Australia, the University of Melbourne? Could it be the one? Let's see the QS1 uh, university ranking. Let's uh, describe the top uni university. It includes the top three universities. Uh, top three universities are the MIT, number one, the second is the Stanford University, and the third is the Harvard. The tenth one is the University of the Chicago. These are the top ten universities uh, uh, as per the QS1 university. Now, the ranking indicator used in the QS World University Ranking 2020 uh, is it, uh, the number one criteria international student ratio, the second is the international faculty ratio, faculty student ratio, citation per faculty, academic reputation, and employer reputation. Now, the best university for your PhD is studies. The university that can meet your expectation for completing your PhD studies is the best university for your PhD study. That is the best university. Let's see how you can meet your aspiration and what could be the way forward for your aspiration and expectation. Now, what you should consider in choosing a university for the PhD study. Number one, your subject area of study for the PhD study. Number two, it is uh, uh, to know the subject area of your uh, for the PhD study is good to accommodate your undergraduate and postgraduate subject strengths that you already have. Your secondly, uh, your career goal should be related with the subject area. If you are doing an on-job PhD, your aspiration can be different to someone who is doing the PhD without having the job. Now the uh, what you should consider in choosing a uni university for a PhD study. Your motivation to, uh, in the chosen subject area, it's important. PhDs require considerable involvement. So your motivation is very important for the continuous hard work. Then faculty uh, research strength where you are going for the PhD studies. Is the university uh, having the faculty in your subject area with good uh, research strength? Then the laboratory facility to support your PhD studies. It's, uh, it could be the applied practical, uh, applied and practical part of the subject area. Then learning resources where you are going to run your uh, PhD studies. Then a professional exposure to the uh, to associate yourself with the professional societies, conferences, and presenting uh, and refining the PhD research studies. Then. Career development assistance you are you should be having there, particularly when you are starting the PhD without having a job. Yeah, that just means you are doing the PhD at a time when you was uh, not having a job. Then the best university for PhD studies, best university for your PhD studies depends upon how well concerned you are in knowing the area and the your expectation and aspirations for doing the PhD. University that can deliver the best to your known expectations is the best university for your PhD study. That is the way forward for choosing the best university for your PhD. Thanks for your attention. Uh, we welcome for your uh, suggestions and feedback for the improvement. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. That's it.